All right, so let's begin our story time with um, getting married. So I've been with Aw, my, uh, my wife now, for about eight or nine years. We got together pretty quickly before, pretty quickly when I got to Thailand. I mean, I probably came in like <clears throat> middle of August 2015. By Christmas, I think we were probably at the beginning of a relationship. I mean, looking back, that was quick. If I was smarter <clears throat> and a bit wiser, I probably would have lived out my bachelor, you know, it would, I would have liked my barbarian bachelor in Asia period to have lasted you know a couple of years at least rather than a few months but I mean this is just just what happens unfortunately you uh, you think you're going to be single and going around Southeast Asia basically dating every model between here and Phnom Penh and Ho Chi Minh and um, you end up meeting one good one quite early on and thinking, all right, fair enough. I'll, um, I'll take my cards off the table. Um, yeah, so anyway, that happened. And to be honest, we've had a really, really, really great relationship. Uh, we've been all over the world. We've met, uh, she's come to the UK to meet with me. Met my family many, many times. Um, I finally love her. Yeah, anyway, so, and then we've been living together. I've been living in her house for about eight, eight years. and. It's basically been like we've got married, and in fact, when when we did decide to, you know, make make it formal, I did tell her that you know don't expect Prince Charming suddenly to be to be to emerge. Uh, I'm not going to be any worse, and I'm not going to be any better. It's just it's going to be the same. Um, I, 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 she's happy, happy with that. We, we are we are happy together. So yeah, about a year and a half ago, I think I was having a few beers in Hua Hin with or oh, probably too many beers and uh, she obviously realized I had too much to drink because she used that as an opportunity to pin me down on this whole wedding business which to be fair after eight years is probably about you know about the right time anyway um, she asked me what my visa plans were for the next year or two and I explained it and then after that she says and then we'll move to the marriage visa right and um, I agreed to that. And what that started was basically, a, you know, almost two years, but a year and a half of, of planning, quite serious planning, um, planning our, 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 our wedding. And I'm gonna show you our wedding video in a, in a, in a, in a minute. Um, it was the most amazing wedding. Um, certainly not something that I would have thought would be, you know, you know my wedding. Um, it actually was quite a low budget wedding compared to UK or, or Western prices, but it looked absolutely, you know, it looked like a no budget wedding. Um, and it was absolutely, it was just amazing. Uh, not just for that, but also, you know, all of my family came. There was about 30 people from the UK and France, and some of them I hadn't seen in, in years. Like I hadn't seen my little brother in maybe ten years, and we got to we got to go out. I got to show him around Thailand, Thailand um, show him about my life, show him how how amazing this this country is, and how much it's developed over the last couple of years, after the couple of decades. Um, so yeah, it was just it was just the most amazing day, surrounded by you know people that had travelled all over, travelled thousands of miles to come and to come and see me. Would see us, and um, and everyone had a really nice time, which was really was the, was the goal for my wedding. Um, I mean, I knew the wedding wouldn't be necessarily fun for me or or my wife. It was basically like a full time job, running around, making sure everybody was happy. But my mission was to make sure that all the people that had travelled from the UK, from France, from from Russia, my God. Um, wouldn't go home and think it wasn't quite worth the journey. And uh, I think I've achieved that. Um, 
so yeah, I'll stop talking and uh, boring you all. And then here is a three minute clip of my wedding day. So enjoy, thank you.